Hello, everyone. This is attorney Connie Kaplan. We help immigrants everywhere make the United States their permanent home. Part of that process is filing applications with USCIS, and part of filing those applications is failing, uh, paying filing fees to the government. The government just announced today that the filing fees will be going up. They are going up beginning October 2nd. Any application that is filed or postmarked after October 2nd, 2020, will have to have the new fees. That being said, what is going to be affected by it? On some cases, some applications fees have gone down. When, we are, when they have gone down, they got down by 3 to 5 percent so not significant. However, it is very, very rare that only one application gets filed with USCIS. In most cases, we file multiple applications at the same time. Overall, the package price for the whole thing, just going to USCIS, the fees are higher. To give you an example, a regular petition for alien relative, the fees have only gone up $15 on an I-130. However, the fees for other applications have gone up. An application for naturalization, regular and 400, it's up 81%. The new filing fee is $1,160. If you have not filed your application yet, now it's time to file it. This is not the time to delay. If you're thinking you don't have money now, come October, you definitely won't. Um, there is also a big difference between filing on paper versus filing electronically for those applications that are available to be filed electronically, not everything can. There is a difference in um, filing fee of about three to 5% in most cases between filing electronically or filing on paper. The good news is there is still no application fee for self-petitioning uh, individuals under the Violence Against Women's Act or for you and T visas, which is something we do regular basis, and the biometrics fees is down. Listen, guys, if you have not filed your application yet, now is the time. Do not wait until October 2nd. Don't wait until then. The process has already, it's already difficult enough. The process has gotten worse in the past few months, and we don't know what is going to become at that time. And uh, if you need time to prepare a proper application that has the best chance and odds of being approved. It requires documentation, requires you collecting documents, talking to us on a regular basis to make sure we do the proper job, right? So do it now, don't wait until uh, then. Looking forward to hearing from you guys if you guys have any questions whatsoever.